my reign caused the deaths of over 1 million people. I also ordered the execution of 7,000 people who did not mourn the death of my mother, Queen Nondi, enough. My name is King Shoka Zulu, one of the most influential monarchs of the Zulu kingdom. I was born out of wedlock and was consequently exiled with my mother. She was my only refuge during these trying times. I grew up in a settlement, where I served as a warrior and developed unique combat skills. I soon became the fiercest warrior in my clan. When my father, the king of the Zulu kingdom, passed away in 1816, my half-brother took the throne. His reign was short-lived as I assassinated him, enabling me to finally become chief of the Zulu clan. I reorganized the Zulu's military system with ruthless discipline and innovations, it grew it into a formidable force of 40,000 soldiers. I induced the ruthless determination in my army by instilling the knowledge of the brutal fate that awaited them and their families in the case of defeat. I conquered many territories, some with force and others with diplomacy, until I controlled all the neighboring settlements. When my beloved mother passed away in 1827, the grief engulfed me and I forced the entire kingdom to mourn her. I ordered that no new crops be planted for a year as well as the killing of all pregnant women. Around 7,000 people were executed for not mourning enough for my mother. In 1828, everyone had grown tired of my cruelty and were ready to revolt. I was assassinated by my two half-brothers and buried in an unmarked grave. Like and follow for more Air African stories.